Question 6 is a 70 kg woman and her 35 kg son are standing at rest on an ice rink as shown above. They push against other for a time of 0 0.60 second causing them to glide apart. The speed of the woman immediately after the separate is 0 0.55 meter per second. Assume that during the push friction is negligible compared with the forces the people exert on each other. Calculate the initial speed of the sun after the push. So we need to find the initial speed of sun after the push. Uh, so for that, we will apply the law of conservation of momentum. So here, initial momentum is equal to final momentum. Because initially, they mentioned that they both are standing at rest. They push against each other for a 0 0.60 second. So initially, they both are at rest. So initial momentum is 0. Final momentum is momentum of woman plus momentum of sun. Momentum of woman is 70 into its speed after the separate is 0 0.55. And plus mass of sun is 35. And let's say the speed of sun is V. So from here, we can write V is equal to minus 70 into 0 0.55 divided by 35. And so here after calculation, we will get the value as 1.1 meter per second. So this is the speed of the sun, initial speed of the sun after the push. And why it shows the negative sign here, you can write the answer in positive. Basically, the negative sign represents that they both are because they both are moving in opposite direction, like moving backward because they are pushing against each other. Right. So that's a negative sign here. Now the B part is calculate the magnitude of the average force exerted on the sun by the mother during the push. So for that, uh, we can use the relation, we can use uh, the formula as force is equal to average force into time. That is impulse is equal to change in momentum, right? So average force we need to find here. So from here, average force is equal to change in momentum over change in time. So the momentum change in momentum for that we need to find the force exerted on sun by the mother. So change in momentum we can write it as so force is exerted on the sun right so mass of sun into change in speed of sun so divided by time period and the time period is given as 0 0.60 and here mass of sun is 35 kg and so the change in speed so initial speed after the push is 0 0.55 and then in the speed becomes 0. So, no, sorry, not 0 0.55. We calculated here 1.11. So, 1.1 minus 0 divided by 0 0.60. So, here it comes out to be average force as 64 Newton. Now, C part is how do the magnitude and direction of the average force exerted on the mother by the son during the push compared with those average force exerted on the son by the mother. Justify your answer. See, we can say here uh, that according to Newton's third law, the, both the forces will be equal and opposite. That is the average force exerted on mother by the son will be equal and opposite to the average force exerted on son by the mother. So this is according to the Newton's third law. Now the D part is after the initial push, the friction that the ice exerts cannot be considered negligible and the mother comes to rest after moving a distance of 7 meter across the ice. If the coefficient of friction are same, how far does the sun move after the push? So we need to find the distance moved by the sun. So first what we will do, we will find the acceleration of the woman uh, for that. So we can use a so that equation v square equal to u square plus 2as. So final so now the after the push the mother comes to rest. So the final speed is 0. Initially woman uh, the mother was moving with the speed of 0 0.55 and plus 2 into acceleration we need to calculate and the distance covered by mother is 7 meter. Right. So here it is 7. So we need to use here minus 7, right? And uh, then after that, we will get the value as, so So we can consider one direction as positive. Let's say all the directions towards the right are positive. Now, after that, we'll get the value of acceleration as 0 
टू टू मीटर पर सेकेंड के सो दिस इज एक्सलेशन ऑफ द वुमेन लेट से इट इज ए डब्ल्यू नाउ नेक्स्ट वी नीड टू फाइंड द एक्सलेशन ऑफ द सन सो इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड द एक्सलेशन ऑफ द सन सो सी बट वी कैन से फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल द एक्सलेशन वी कैन डायरेक्टली से दैट द एक्सलेशन ऑफ बोथ द मदर एंड द सन दीज आर सेम so are same in the magnitude so since and uh, so also we know that this acceleration it is caused by the frictional force so we can write here that frictional force is equal to mu into contact force and contact force we can write it as mg and this is the only force that is acting on the system so here it will be equal to m into a right and they mention that if the coefficient of the coefficient of frictions are also same so how far does the sun move right yeah so here first of all we can will get the value of a is equal to mu g so and acceleration is same uh, because the acceleration of sun is equal to acceleration of women so it is 0.022 meter per second square and now we need to find the distance moved by the sun for that we can use this equation v square equal to u square plus 2 as so v is the final speed of the sun the sun will also come to rest and u is the initial speed of sun which is 1.1 that we calculated in the part um in the a part plus 2 into acceleration of sun so the acceleration of sun here uh, it comes out to be because they are equal and opposite right so acceleration of sun is equal to equivalent opposite to the acceleration of women so we can write it as 0.0.022 meter per second square so here 2 into minus 0.022 into distance moved we need to calculate so from here we'll get the value of the distance moved as 28 meter so this is the required distance moved by the sun one point one more point that i want to mention here that why the acceleration of sun will be equal to the acceleration of women because here that i already shown it here if you can see here acceleration it comes out to mu g right if we write this acceleration for sun and uh, women separately you can see here coefficient of friction they said same g is also same if we divide it separately you can see it will come out to be 1 because mu g mu g cancel out so as will come out to be aw so that's why i have written directly here i didn't men i didn't show this working because it's there is no need to show this working part in a solution you can just directly after this you can just directly write this value but their magnitudes are different but yes definitely they are uh, they are moving in the opposite direction so here they will they will be a change of sign for the women in the previously we calculated as positive and then so for the sun it will be negative 